I don't know that that is the case. Um, I've heard the same rumors that you have heard. Um, I, I, I delisted. What I've heard is that there are concerns because, of course, students sometimes go back and make complaints. I, I don't know. You'll understand as well that right here in, in Belize, the two schools are rivals. You've seen this already, where sometimes, uh, as I've described to you the last time, there are paid mercenaries who go and work and, 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 and uh, criticize schools and create the mischief. Maybe that it, it is that mischief that has gotten its way back to, to the, maybe as far as the embassy in Mexico and then later on to the, to the Indian government, no? But uh, I don't know of any kind of, um, uh, illegal practices on the part of any of these two schools. As far as I am concerned, both schools are properly chartered here in Belize and uh, when we are able to check on them, uh, they are providing the services that they say they are providing. And um, I don't know about their delisting in, in, in India at all. We, we, there certainly has been no, um, no kind of official communication coming from the Indian government uh, to our ministry or our government about any such thing.